What was the, what was the first <laughs> thing? What was the first thing I said when I landed in Australia? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Wait, I feel like I could be a meme. Hey, I'm Mariana Hewitt. And I'm Lauren, and we are the co-founders of Summer Fridays. And today we're gonna play a little game about how well do we know each other. Be like, Welcome to our show. Oprah together. <laughs> Welcome to Oprah's <laughs> channel. Okay. What was your first impression of me? Oh, I loved you so much. I'm like extra <laughs> cheesy. I, lo <laughs> I loved you. I thought you were super pretty Ooh. and really nice. We're both from the Midwest, so I thought, I like knew that we would, we're the same. We would love each other. <laughs> we were the same. What are my nicknames? Lulu. Oh, that is my nickname. Her <laughs> niece calls her Lulu, and Lauren's blog name is You and Lou because when her niece couldn't say Lauren, she called her Lou. I know, it's so sweet. What is my star sign? Libra. We're, we're both bo Libras. We're both Libras. I think that's why we're good partners. <laughs> what is my catchphrase? I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> I think I say I'm so excited like at least a dozen times. Today. Literally everything we were saying earlier today. It's, if we never ever need to get something like embroidered for her or like customized, yes. it's gonna say I'm so excited. It's like extra cheesy. What is the most diva thing I do? You're not a diva at all. There's like nothing literally oh. a diva about you. I can't even like think about anything that you like really need. Lauren's like so humble, down to earth, so friendly. Oh, There's nothing, like nice. literally nothing. Love you. Love you. <laughs> Describe me as a Summer Fridays mask. Ooh. Oh my, well you are literally all of our masks because <laughs> you're jet lag, because you're literally always <laughs> flying. Like Marion is on a plane. You average a plane ride like every three days, mm -hmm. literally every three days you're on the plane. Overtime for sure because you're always working, but in the best way. You're the most efficient, creative, humble, hardworking, like Aww. all all of the adjectives to be the best partner. Um, and I dress like an R&R &R And you dress like an R&R, &R, like literally always in blush. What is my favorite restaurant? Ooh. Uh, well, in LA, we have a place called John and Vinny's and it has incredible Italian food and it actually is like special to both of us now because when we first launched Summer Fridays, that first day we ordered John and Vinny's, we ordered it in and then when we have our one year anniversary, we're gonna order it again. So now it's, it's like best. a special tradition for us. A fun fact about Lauren and I is we love food like, and love we food. like love to go out to eat and we mm -hmm. over order because we like to have bites of everything. Mm -hmm. So it's great because the two of us together, we can eat an entire menu. Okay, to that point, what dish would I never order off of a menu? Oh, never? Kind of That's hard because I, I feel like you like a lot of things. Yeah. I don't think anything's off limits. No, I, I really do order, I yeah, can't even I don't think, think of something that I like, wouldn't don't order like. off a menu. No, I like everything. What is my in-flight routine? Oh my gosh, you have <laughs> Marina has like a very serious in-flight routine that I have now adopted. You never come on the plane with makeup. You always have a super fresh face. You come in and you like immediately organize everything. You mm -hmm. have a whole system. <laughs> and also like, you don't like it when people get in your the way of your system. Yeah. <laughs> like not too many interruptions to the system. <laughs> um, but you get in, mm -hmm. you put on jet lag mask, mm -hmm. always like a thick layer, especially on your under eyes. Usually you do a serum too, like your eyes mm -hmm. clinical serum. Um, then you have your silk sleep eye mask mm -hmm. that you put on. You put your uh, headphones on <laughs> and then <laughs> you put your mask over you. You have your blanket. Sometimes you have a special pillow because uh, like you don't like the way that the, sometimes mm -hmm. the air, airlines feel just because yeah. it gives you a weird reaction. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, that's it. You're right. Mm -hmm. That's it. What was the first thing I said when I landed in Australia? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. With like shaking the arms, hands. I like literally this. like shake. Like you know Buddy the Elf? Uh -huh. That's like Lauren. It's like oh, me. So I feel excited. like I could be a meme. I just like yeah. get really excited. And now my kid does it too. He's one and he's always like, ah, I'm so excited. <laughs> What are my pet peeves? Oh, this, okay, well, when people are late, which is like actually <laughs> not good because I'm always really late. And I know that's one of your biggest pet peeves, so I'm like trying to work on it. What is my most cherished item of clothing? I wouldn't say it's an item of clothing, but it's um, jewelry is sentimental for you. Yeah. So either something from your husband or your family that's really meaningful, or like something that says your son's name. So it was more jewelry yeah. than clothing. Yeah, I have my I have my grandmother's wedding bands on and my mama bracelet. Everything is like very sentimental. Mm -hmm. She's right. Besides, oh, is it your turn? My turn. Uh, I think it's your turn. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Besides Summer Fridays, what beauty product can I not live without? Ooh, well, you have a couple of favorites. Um, your NARS Creamy Concealer, mm -hmm. which you are obsessed with. Tatcha's Luminous Dewy Skin Mist which we both is love. another favorite. Your Dr. Dennis Gross Pads. Yeah, pads. that's a very long name. I'm like, I know it. <laughs> those are the, those that's, are the top Yeah, ones. I feel like yeah. those, those are like really your top, yeah. What would be my theme song? 
right now it's baby shark doo 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 doo. Baby shark doo doo. It's so funny because it's like stuck in her head and she wants to make it all of her Instagram captions <laughs> now. It's, so it's all I listen to. And then before that though, Lauren only knows and plays one song all year long, no matter when it is, and it's Mariah Carey. Yes, it's a Christmas song. <laughs> How would you describe my beauty and fashion style? I would say elevated minimal. So I, you really do that best and Thank very you. neutral, which yeah, we, we both neutral. love. But you have really good basics that are mm -hmm. super elevated and always very chic and put together, but you're never too dressed up. I like an effortless, like comfortable feel. I uh -huh. never like to feel uncomfortable in anything I'm wearing. So yeah. everything needs to be like actually wearable. Yeah. Do I speak any other languages? Well, not really, but Lauren mm -hmm. is half Lebanese. Yeah, I, yeah, Lebanese. Yeah. yeah. And My so I feel like so your dad, says some things and like your son yeah. says some things and you have your Tata speaks uh -huh. to you. I speak some Arabic. Like Yalla Habibi is like mm -hmm. hurry up sweetie or I know like a lot of the cuss words <laughs> which I won't share in case anyone watching speaks Arabic. <laughs> is there a fun fact about me that always surprises people? Well okay two things. One, she, you grew up with your dad mm -hmm. um, and you grew up flying between Ohio and Germany mm -hmm. um, which I love because like Ohio is like the heart of the uh -huh. US, and then I feel like Germany is just, it like feels so, so far. it feels so far away, um, and also super unique. And then also, fun fact, is that you worked as a TV host, which some, some people know, but mm -hmm. I don't know if they know that you like got up at four in the morning mm -hmm. to work as a TV host for a while. So I think people don't realize that we had like lives before the internet. Yeah, we had <laughs> we, we had other real jobs mm -hmm. before, before all of this. What Summer Fridays mask do I love the most? Jet lag. I feel mm -hmm. like you use jet lag for like anything and everything, and the best thing is Lauren was out somewhere, and she was traveling and forgot it and she went to a store and bought it because that's how much she can't live I could, without I it. I cannot live without it. <laughs> and also I think it's extra special because when Lauren was pregnant with Evan is when we were formulating mm. it. What was I most excited about coming to Australia? Ooh. You were really excited to be here with Mecca. You've like already cried happy mm. tears twice, like literally happy so tears twice today because you were so excited about it. And then I would also say the food mm -hmm. because you're a foodie. Every single meal we've had since we've been here has been good. Yeah. And I'm a very picky food eater, so the fact that I've loved all meals so far I would come back mm. just to eat here. And we get really good Instagram content here. <laughs> <laughs> like everything is very picturesque and beautiful. What is my biggest fear? Um, I don't know if it's like a fear, but I think it'd be like learning how to balance it all. Mm, like yeah, not a, a fear, one. but it's just like a, it's like, a, my like an awareness. Struggle. Yeah, yes. like a struggle. It's like just making sure between like life, work, motherhood, mm -hmm. like personal, professional, just like figuring it out. And I think you say it best, it's like, it's like a perfect imbalance. Yes, yes. If you had to pick another career for me, what would it be? Oh, oh my gosh, I could think of so many because you have so many talents, but two things, either, well, Oprah, mm -hmm. which, I mean, I think we could both be, we could be like, Welcome to our show. Oprah together. <laughs> Welcome to <laughs> Oprah's channel. I also think you would be a really incredible creative director, which, I mean, you do do that with Summer Fridays, but like, if you didn't have your own brand, you could do it for honestly any <laughs> brand like i feel like you could you could be like the creative director for like a tire company and, <laughs> and it would somehow, cool somehow be like cool and magical and elevated and beautiful how would i spend my perfect summer friday you would wake up in the morning you would go down to the kitchen you would have <laughs> you would make a smoothie with evan <laughs> then you would, I would go for a run or uh -huh. something and then yeah. we would work all day and then in the afternoon, <laughs> we would work all day. And then you would be in Malibu, and then you would have like a sunset beach walk with like your husband and your dog and your baby. Uh -huh. And then you would have a glass of rose or mom juice, as Lauren likes to yeah. call it. And then you would put Evan to bed, and then you would have alone time with Jake, her husband, uh -huh. without your cell phone. Yes, wow. <laughs> like you nailed, that was so detailed. Was perfect day. That was really detailed. And my last one is who is my beauty icon? I can't think of like one specific person for you, but you like really do look to your social community, mm -hmm. I think. Like you're constantly saving things, sharing things. Like I'm like super inspired by the internet. Like yes. I, I have saved and screenshot so many things. So I'd say yeah. my beauty icons are like random girls I've never even met on like Instagram. And I have a saved folder yes. of their pictures on my phone. Yes, and then you send them to me. Yeah. <laughs> and then we're like weirdly stalking everyone on the internet. And then we see them in person and we're like, oh my gosh, do we know you? And then we don't know them. And then we, we just don't, we never don't met them. them before. Yeah. Okay, is that it? That's it. How did we do? I think we got 100%. That was super fun. I think we know each other, but we're work wives. We say yeah. that we're like married in work. So I feel like we know each other. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> Bye guys.